Dwayne Johnson finally makes his superhero dreams come true as Black Adam in the upcoming- Whoa, is he turning that guy into a skeleton? On this IMD Brief, we break down the comic book origins of this mighty anti-hero, how he fits into upcoming DC films, and everything else we know about Black Adam. Johnson has been trying to make this role happen for nearly 15 years, around the same time that he was also trying to shed his pro wrestling nickname and persona. This artist, formerly known as The Rock, was actually first approached to play a superhero in 2006, but instead found himself intrigued by the film's bad guy, an ancient warrior who is corrupted by the supernatural powers bestowed upon him by a wizard named Shazam. Wait, for real? Yep. That's the one. This bewhiskered wizard empowers the young Billy Batson with similar abilities to Black Adam a few millennia later. But so far, Billy and his super alter ego, who is also named Shazam, has been doing mostly good with the gifts he's been given. Have fun. Shazam supporting the local economy? Anyway, back to 5,000 years ago when Black Adam was plundering the fictional nation of Kondok. The wizard Shazam realizes that Adam is out of control and banishes his evil creation to the farthest star. But Adam just flies back to Earth over the next 5,000 years. And apparently, he returns with a real bad attitude. Eventually, Black Adam will have to sort this all out with Shazam the Wizard, Shazam the Superhero, and Shazam's family of five young misfits who were more recently imbued with similar superpowers. Unfortunately for this crew, they don't seem to know what Black Adam has in store for them. Well, whoever it is, I'm gonna love them no matter what, because they're an automatic part of the family. Before that coming dust up, Likely in Shazam's sequel, Fury of the Gods, Black Adam will have to square off against the Justice Society, not League. This comic book supergroup actually predates all the other teams with a lineup that has included heroes such as... I play Hawkman. Cyclone. Adam Smasher. Dr. Fate. Now we're talking. Aldous Hodge's Hawkman is the reincarnation of an Egyptian prince, so he'll probably have ancient beef with Black Adam that he'll want to squash with an assist from his teammates on the Justice Society. Along with the power of flight from his metal wings, Hawkman can rely on Cyclone's wind control, Adam Smasher's size manipulation, and Dr. Fate's magical helmet. Having done James Bond for 10 years, four films, Nothing compares to this. Not even singing ABBA with Meryl. When you're gone, when you're gone, oh, I try, how can I get beyond? Jungle Cruise director Jaume Collette Sarah promises to reveal a darker side of Dwayne Johnson's persona, even comparing Black Adam to Clint Eastwood's Dirty Harry. Now you know why they call me Dirty Harry. Every dirty job that comes along. But we'll have to wait and see just how dirty The Rock gets in Black Adam. Until then, stay glued to imdb.com slash imdbrief.